Tuesday the 9th of May. We're starting the session with um, some conditioning that has a skill focus. So the idea here is that you're gonna row quite hard. You've got that set of calories to row in 60 seconds, and then you're gonna go immediately into a handstand hold. And this is basically to practice um, the handstand hold under a little bit of fatigue. So you have that target of hitting 30 seconds every time. Of course, if you can do that freestanding, then go for that. If you can, if you are very good at handstands, then try and just put a sort of tape line on the floor and try and stay completely still. So your hands stay on the tape line. If you're just kind of getting to grips with handstand holds, then maybe set a one by one meter box. And so you can move around inside that box, but you stay on your hands. And if it's something you really struggle with, then try and have a training partner spot you so you can do assisted holds or using a wall for that assisted hold. After the intervals, we'll move on to the strength work. If you have um, more than 90 minutes in your training session, you can include this optional piece, which is building to a heavy single strip press. Um, if not, if you're on a, a shorter a time period, then you just go straight ahead to those jerks and you're doing the behind the next split jerk and the split jerk just at eight at 10 RPE. So it's, stay, it's decently heavy, but definitely not towards a max, keeping a bit more of a technical focus today. After that, we have another conditioning piece, a slight variation on what they did in quarterfinals with the snatches and crossovers. It's a much lighter, lower volume version today. And we're gonna to build towards retesting that quarterfinal workout in, in the near future, because I think it's gonna be really interesting to see how good the scores can be now that people are not gonna be so surprised by crossovers. That's becoming quite a normal movement in people's training now. So it'd be interesting to see how much intensity you can apply to that quarterfinals workout now that everyone or most people have crossovers down pretty good. And then finish the session. Again, this is an optional piece, but just some gymnastic holds, mostly focus on core and straight arm strength.